Here we are at Stately Royal Manor. Place is heavily guarded, this being one of the more high class families. I'm just doing my job, so they don't have coming. Filth. <coughs> How to get in? Now, you may recall we found an invitation to this party in that safe in a previous level. That belonged to the art dealer. Yeah, when we looted his safe. That's one of the ways in. Though not the only one. Alternately, sometimes you can, another one will sort of blow by, <laughs> although, for some reason I think it was a bug or something, I couldn't pick it up properly. Hmm. There are other ways as well. <laughs> for instance, if you position yourself right, you can leap over the wall in the fence. But you gotta be careful because it's, you know, lined with pointy bits. Can you die from them? Yes, you can. Uh. Like, they don't instantly kill you, but they damage you. Oh, <laughs> as do these! Rats! We've already dispatched the uh, tall boys on this street. Experimenting to see if I can scale the walls. Scale the wall. There we go. <laughs> On top of the street light. And from there onto that post. And from there into the yard. So they've just been constantly shooting off fireworks, huh? Yeah, they have quite the stockpile. They are well supplied. It's like it's Disney. Yeah. Yeah, we talked about that. Ah, uh, yeah. Let's see. Now just act casual, like you didn't just come in over the wall using your dark magics. Oh, Lord yes. Shaw! The, you were asked to give him a letter, remember? Yes. This is a note from Lord Trevor Pendleton. Pendleton? Hmm. What's he got to say to me? Remember, this is a mask party, so... Pendleton right. is a gutless, lying sack of shit. I hope he's paying you well for this. <laughs> Wait, what have we gotten ourselves into? Well, it's to... damn cold tonight. Hurry up, and let's see what you're made of. Apparently, we have unwittingly delivered him a challenge to a duel. Pendleton's representative has a pistol. You may proceed. Contest of honor will take place between this anonymous gentleman acting for the challenger, Lord Trevor Pendleton, and Lord Shaw, the challenged party. You will each turn and proceed to the marked positions and remain facing away from each other as I count down from three. You may then turn and fire Get at Get on with it. I'll kill this fool and we can all go back inside. Kind of like Sorry, to imagine that this is the protagonist we of Hotline proceed. Miami. <laughs> that mask. All right. Now we're going to fight a duel. For some reason. Stop! Stand right there. Three. Two. And at the count of zero, we turn and fire. One. But there's no rule specifically saying you have to move at the normal flow of time. So. <laughs> Impossible! And that's another patron dead. What do we do now? It's lucky we're in demand. I hear the Estermonts pay top coin. Just throw them on the pile, I no suppose. No use trying them tonight. Let's see if we can find a little brandy. Let the boils clean up the mess. Well, with that unpleasant business com concluded, ah, a nice, sna nice post-murder snack. Huh. Apricot tartlet. Sounds tasty. 
actually, um, I think I remember mm -hmm. a, a site mm -hmm. talking about how to make those. Apricot tartlets? Game. Yeah. Really? It's like gourmet gaming or something. <laughs> Um, we could just go inside. Yeah. That would be a little too simple. Refresh my memory. Do these people care if Most you do the like anything? Inside. Might be short best of murdering them. Well um, the these guys do. When you go inside, as you'll see, most of the party the guests D &D. have a remarkably blasé so. attitude about. About whatever. Personal property, or at least other people's personal property. <laughs> now, those doors are not the only way inside Casadin Coil. Just poke around over here, not much there. I see the fireworks. It really makes me wonder, like, how indicative this is of real life. What do you mean? Like, if I got into a rich person party, could I just go around taking things and people would be like, hmm... It'd be an interesting experiment. Although then I might not see you for one to three years. <laughs> that depends. That's what this one I am. Oh, okay, now I can climb up here. There's more than one way to skin a cat, or in this case, to enter a party. A rare show of mercy on my part. And he is out cold. Let's go to the second mansion, second floor. Forbidden! Nothing is forbidden to Corvo Atano. Oh! Please enjoy yourself. Inside. I don't remember why I did that. The party's in. Aside from being an idiot. This time. Fastest way down. Well, well, blinking would have been equally fast. And... Hello. The Boyles hope you have a wonderful yeah, I, time. That's right. I believe I. I go. I go inside the, the regular way first, just to sort of you know case the joint a little. Now we're that's gonna meet cute. the. Uh, we spent a lot of time in, you know, the, the gutters, as it were. Now we're going to meet Dunwall High Society. I should have taught him some Remember, it's a masquerade. This party is a sham. I'm sure he's Which is why I'm going around in my Doctor Doom mask like in public and no one cares. <laughs> Excuse me, my cousin is a Marquis. Of course I don't mean you, but people are desperate, and the boils are off. Notice the wall of light in the background. Nonsense. Waverly just hires officers from the Watch to impress people. Your obsession with the Boyle women. Will it never end? So is is this one of those um, murder mystery parties? She uh, beats not servants. Not exactly, but the Boyles the rich still cling to the belief that the plague will only <coughs> sicken the poor. We've got some disembodied heart social commentary out. going here. And when it does. Things will not go well. These are the standard aristocrat lines for men. This months. was once the house of Ooh, a high overseer. Lydia Boyle took special care to desecrate each and every room. Yep. Old friends are cut from the guest list at the merest rumor of plague. Desecrate he is very every rich room. And powerful. What's that? Desecrate every room. Yep. You'll never believe this. What is it now? She had her jobber pick up a boy in the street, barely 16 years old. No family left. I thought her interests were confined to her family. I think she ran out of family a while ago. What's it all about? And how do you know this? My servants heard it from her, naturally. They were sexual rights, I can only assume. <laughs> what the hell? Else. I heard she bathed in her own Bathed in her own blood. nephew's blood. Ridiculous. What sort of hygiene is that? <laughs> <It's> <laughs> That's what you're worried about? That's hygienic attributes? To keep them safe. Emma, you could get her sent to the Abbey. Nobody that rich gets sent anywhere they don't want. 
The Brimsley's made an awful lot of money this you know, like past century. As we said before, the like worship of the outsider is illegal, but some people will engage in rituals. I hear he enjoys right. himself very much. And, like, a lot, and people... Well, of course, yes. rumors. Ah, there's one of the Boyles. We don't know which. They're three Boyle sisters. They're each wearing a mask and different colored Welcome clothes. Welcome to my party. I don't believe you've had the pleasure. Lydia, Waverly, Esma, White, Black, Red. There has to be a clue upstairs as to who's the city get any worse. Yoink! Fifty coins. Oh, they got a foosball table. Now see that big box that overseer's carrying? Yes. Remember that mu remember that music that can like undo your magic? That's what that is. No weapons at the party. Put it His away. His entire sir. family was taken by the plague. It's just him. Now. Unfortunately, you can't take out the heart without also drawing your weapon. Hmm. Although you probably presumably w walking around with a disembodied clockwork heart would also catch attention. I trust you are on the guest list, sir. Why? Uh, of course. Of course I am. You a gentleman? I'll have you know I'm as gentle as I need to be in any given situation. As I think I've proven. I told you not to bring that up. There's a great deal I could offer you. Don't be silly. The rumors say the Boyles practically own your estate. What if I said I could get you out of the city, away from all this, to Sir Conos or further? I don't believe what you. What is he dressed but as? But if you're telling the truth, a whale? Talk further. Uh, that's what I was thinking. Excuse me. Oh, leave him be. It's a party. <laughs> this is a private conversation. It's a party. It's called mingling. Mingle all you want, then. We'll speak later. I'll find you. Good yeah, evening. The... Here's a mystery. Are you perhaps with the Campbells? A cousin? Yeah, there's three boils that are in disguise in three different colors, and the party guests are being challenged to guess who's who. Only she knows what really happened the day her invalid mother died. You're a scandal in that mask. I like a man with poor judgment. Would you get me a drink? I think she's a bee. So grateful. I thought she was a bunny. Doing all right there? Go Bo ahead, help yourself. I take everything. <laughs> They'll never miss it. Recall what I said about personal property. 